Hi there, I'm Joe, the founder of Dad's Guide to Twins.com, and today I'm going to answer one of your most pressing twin parenting questions. So maybe you're getting ready for summer vacation, travel with the family, or maybe just a road trip down to Grandma's house, and you want to know where can the twins sleep when you're away from home so that they're safe. And I'm going to share with you three uh, twin crib-friendly recommendations that we have for when you're traveling on the road. Uh, keep in mind the best safe sleep recommendations for your twins are that they have their own separate sleep surfaces so that they don't uh, interfere with each other that can cause some problems for um, safety when they're sleeping. So let me share these three three options for you. I'll tell you a little bit about what we did with our twins. And uh, for our twins, when we traveled, usually we just had one pack and play and they would share that pack and play when they're really little. Now, ideally, they'd be on the same on the different sleep surface or separated. So that's not the safest route to go, but I know many twin parents still sleep their twins together, especially when they're on a bind, when they're in a hotel room or grandma's house, and there's not a lot of space where they just have one pack and play. So maybe if you're always going to visit grandma and you have a pack and play and grandma has a pack and play, uh, you can bring one and use one at grandma's house. That might work great. So here are a couple options that you may want to consider. Uh, the first one is uh, the Graco uh, Twin Bassinet play, play Yard. Now this thing has these built-in bassinets that sit on the very top which are great for when your babies are very little. And the reality is that they're not gonna stay that little forever. So once your babies reach about 15 pounds, the, the bassinets on the top of this Graco are no longer strong enough to support their weight. And so you just can have the, the basic pack and play that's the bottom part of this piece. So that may be an option if your twins are really little and wanna travel, and if you're happy with just a single pack and play after they uh, start to outgrow the top piece of that. Again, that's the, the Graco uh, pack and play with the twin bassinet attachment. Uh, then the other option is this uh, Juvie Room 2 Portable Play Yard. Now this is really like a huge oversized pack and play and it'll fit both your twins. That's fine. Again, there's no separation between the twins uh, and so if you want them to be in their own separate compartments or safe sleeping areas, this might not be the best bet for you, but there is plenty of room for both your twins at the same, si at the same time. This is the Juvie Room 2 Portable Play Yard. Um, now, the one that I, I really like, it's, it's relatively new on the market in the last uh, year or so, is this Romp and Roost uh, oversized play yard with a removable divider down the middle. Uh, I've met the founders of this company, Romp and Roost. They're, they're amazing ladies. And while they don't have twins, they've designed a product that's perfect uh, for twins. And there's a, diff a different space for each of your twins. You know, baby A can sleep on one side and baby B can sleep on the other side. And this divider down the middle is a nice mesh so they can still you know, see each other and there's still breathable uh, breeze or airway through there without any problems, but they're not gonna physically interfere with each other when they're sleeping, which could be a risk uh, for, for SIDS or other challenges. So if you're looking for a travel crib that will work on your, on your travels, make sure you're measuring before you go buy something. Uh, make sure you have enough space in your trunk of your vehicle, or um, if you're going to a hotel room, think about the floor plan of that hotel room where you can fit one of these things, because once you pop them open, um, they may block uh, exits or they may block walkways between the beds, things like that. So again, this is the Romp and Roost oversized play yard. And uh, th these these are pretty pretty slick. I mean, they've got the nice wheels to move them around and they've got the divider down the middle. It's like perfect, uh, perfect tw for twins. If you would like additional tips and tricks about preparing for or having your twins or overcoming the challenges of raising twins, go ahead and check out some of these other videos and subscribe to the channel for additional tips and tricks to help you along your twin journey. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you next time.